Hello, this is Mark from EasyStartPC.com, and today I'm going to show you how to download and install Dropbox. So you just want to go to Dropbox.com, click on the Download Dropbox link, then the window should automatically pop up to download the newest version, click Save File, And it's going to start downloading. Then once it's done downloading, you want to open up the folder that you downloaded it to. I put it in my downloads folder. Then you just want to double click on the application. and then you want to click run and it will ask you do you want to allow the following program to make changes to this computer you want to click the yes button and then the installation will begin here you just want to click on install Then once the installation is finished, you want to either check one or the other. I don't have a Dropbox account or I already have a Dropbox account. If you're just starting to sign up now, you want to click this one and create a Dropbox account. If you signed up through the link on my website, you can click this circle that you already have a Dropbox account. Click Next type in the information you used when you first signed up for Dropbox and then type in your password then click next and then it's going to default to the 2 gig free plan you can upgrade your account to have 50 gigs or 100 gigs for a different amount each month. I'm just going to go with the 2 gigs. Click Next. Then I'm just going to go through a typical setup. It just makes the default settings. Then after that, it's going to give you a quick overview about Dropbox. This page here tells you that you can access your files from Dropbox.com by logging in on the website. And down at the bottom, there will be a little notification I'll show you later. Then once it gets to the end, that's it. And then when I keep this box checked, that will open my Dropbox folder. Okay, then it adds a nice desktop shortcut on my desktop and it has two default folders public folder photo folders you'll see down here that you have the Dropbox icon on your system tray which you can open the folder quickly from there or exit it or launch the website different settings there Okay, and that's just a real quick video on how to install Dropbox onto your computer. And this is Mark from EasyStartPC.com.